Hello and welcome everyone. So we in the last video we have already discussed four most important questions. Now in this video we are going to talk about ICSC class 10th physics chapter number 2 which is work power and energy. So let's get started. So our first question is define a kilowatt hour and how is it related to joules? This question was asked in the year 2020. Okay. Now let's have a look at the second question. The second question has two parts. Okay, and it is an ICSC 2018 question. The first question says to state and define the SI unit of power. Okay, so don't misunderstand the question that it is asking to define power. No, it is asking. to state also define the si unit means what is the unit of power that you need to define okay now the second part of this question is how is the unit horse power related to the si unit of power okay so this was the second question in which you need to say that how is the unit horse power is related to si unit of power so read the questions carefully although it may seems to you that it is a very easy question but in reality it may be something different now let's see the third question the third question is basically an extension or you can say like a similar question of question number 2 third question says name the physical quantity measured in terms of horse power This question was asked in the year 2015. So you can see that not only I am giving the important question but also I am grouping the similar types of question okay so that you can have a good clarity on how these questions are coming in different different years okay now let's go to question number 4. Question number 4 is basically a reasoning type of question which you must have seen in your book. Is Question states that a satellite revolves around a planet in a circular orbit what is the work done by the satellite at any instant this is the first question and you need to give a reason for whatever the answer you are saying this question was asked in the year 2020 also these question may have been asked in some previous or also but i am just mentioning any of the year okay now let's go to question number 5 see this is an important question because it seems very easy but when you actually give it you need to think of for it okay give an example of each when chemical energy changes into electrical energy okay and the second question is electrical energy changes into sound energy so you need to give one example in which chemical energy changes into electrical energy also an example for which an electrical energy changes into sound energy this question was specifically asked in the year 2020 now let me show you one similar type of question that is very much similar to question number 5 see this question question number 6 Question number 6 says state the energy change in the following cases while in use an electric iron also a ceiling fan so you basically need to state in an electric iron which energy changes to which energy and same is the case with ceiling fan in which you also need to state that in ceiling fan which energy is getting converted to which energy and this question was specifically asked in the year 2018 okay so keep noting these questions because they are in very good sequence okay and if you are comfortable write down the answers along with it now let's go to question number 7 this is a very different type of question and let me mark it as an important question why you will know it in some time see name the unit of physical quantity obtained by the formula 2 here it should be k i think the there is a misprint so no worries 
टू के अपॉन वी स्क्वायर सो यू हैव अ फॉर्मूला लेट मी राइट इट हेयर टू के अपॉन वी स्क्वायर सो दिस इज वॉट इज द फिजिकल क्वांटिटी विच हैज बिन गिवेन एंड हेयर के स्टैंड फॉर काइनेटिक एनर्जी एंड वी विच यू हैव सिंग हेयर इज लीनियर वेलॉसिटी सो यू नीड टू बेसिकली से द आंसर दैट वॉट इज द फिजिकल क्वांटिटी ऑप्टेंड बाय द फॉर्मूला टू के अपॉन वी स्क्वायर I think most of you might be having trouble that is this question from this chapter only let me say you this question is from this chapter only and it has came very recently in the year 2018 so you need to comment down the answer for it okay this is the first question which i am asking you to comment down so comment down the answer if you know otherwise i will tell you the answer okay now let's go to question number 8 so question number 8 is how is the work done by a force measured when the force is in the direction of displacement and when the force is at an angle to the direction of displacement this question was specifically asked in the year 2015 so let me give you a just a hint that you need to basically write the formula when the force is in the direction of displacement and when it is at an angle to the direction of displacement okay now let's go to question number 9 now the question number 9 says calculate the change in kinetic energy of a moving body if its velocity is reduced to 1/3 of the initial velocity now these are not numerical type of question but yes they are soft numericals means they are not compulsorily uh, you can say that these are numerical question because you will see these type of question in your section a okay this question was specifically asked in the year 2014 so you basically need to say that what will be the change in kinetic energy when the velocity is reduced to 1/3 that means it is asking whether the kinetic energy will increase if it will increase then how much increase whether it will become twice or thrice okay so that was the just a hint for you now let me show one similar question related to question number 9 and it was asked in the year 2019 so it is a very recent question so you can see these question are coming in section a so you need to gear it up and you need to be ready for these type of question let me read question number 10 two bodies a and b have masses in the ratio 5 is to 1 and their kinetic energies are in the ratio 125 is to 9 find the ratio of their velocities okay so it is also a kind of soft numerical which will appear in your section a part okay so if you are having trouble kindly google the questions and see the solution because they are very important question okay so friends that's all from this video